Hello, welcome to the video. In this video, I'm going to be explaining biogas and biofuels. Now, biofuels are maybe something that you've heard of before. Um, so, what is a biofuel? Now, essentially, we use microbes to produce these potential different biofuels. Now, what we can do to produce um, biofuels like ethanol is we can use yeast and glucose to actually produce that ethanol. And it's, it's done in anaerobic conditions. That means without oxygen. So if we allow yeast to access glucose in anaerobic conditions, it's going to produce ethanol. Ethanol is a type of alcohol, but it can be used as a biofuel. Now you may have seen some buses around in town uh, on the side saying, I'm a green bus, and with some signs saying it has ethanol as the fuel. That is because it's using those biofuels. Now biogas. Biogas is produced in biogas generators. And what they are often give you in the exam is a diagram of it and they give you some information about different generators and um, they ask you to evaluate that information. So in biogas generators, what we use is we use animal and plant waste. So animal and plant waste materials and then it's provided to microbes. But again, it's in anaerobic conditions, so without oxygen. So no oxygen. And what those microbes produce is they produce methane. And what methane can be used for is it can be used as something called biogas, which is a gas that can be used and burnt to release energy. So that's biogas. Um, and that is one of the positives of using microbes to produce gas. Okay. Um, this could be useful particularly to some maybe rural communities or, country, or countries uh, like third world countries where they need that fuel and they have limited supply of normal fuel so they can use these um, product, produce generators to allow them to produce their fuel. Okay. Um, so you may have to consider some of the environmental conditions when looking at biogas generators. So for example in cold countries it's not going to produce them very effectively because if it's too cold, the microbes won't work properly and won't produce the methane. On the other, the other side of that, if the country is too hot, it could lead to the enzymes in the microbes not working and not being able to produce methane. So that's just the other side of it. So that's biofuels and biogas. Uh, thank you very much for watching. Please like, share and subscribe. Follow me on Twitter at Bushlick Bio. Thank you.